Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, what is going on? Kyle here, back playing some Forza Horizon 2. We are in the murdered out uh, Mazda RX-7 that we built previously uh, in a drift build. You guys have probably seen that by now. And um, we're going to get back into this little let's play. We're going to start this... Uh, well, I thought we were going to start this road trip, but... We're going to start it right now. I have no idea what hey we're going to select. Bug you, but now would totally be a good time to pick out a new car. You can get a feel for it on the way to our next stop before things get serious again. Uh, I kind of want to do the American um, the American Muscle Group B Monsters Championship. Hmm, what do we want to do? We'll do the muscle for right now. I don't think we've done anything uh, so far related to American muscle. What do we want to do? Could do the CUDA. Does have the most power. But, honestly, I would rather drive the, uh, the SS, the Camaro. So, we're going to do the 69 Camaro. See what we can do with this thing. That looks really cool. But, um, I'm just going to stick to a manufacturer color. Probably do, like, a, um, let's see, what, what could we do? I like the black a lot. Maybe we'll do like a silver, or we'll do bumblebee. We want to bumblebee it out. Eh. We'll do the black. I, I like the black with the white. It's the typical uh, Camaro muscle car look. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to drive this to... I have no idea where we're driving to. Or we're driving somewhere. Uh, I just don't know where. So yeah, um, hopefully you guys have been enjoying this Let's Play. Uh, I've been having a blast. Uh, I plan on busting out a lot more of this. All right, are we all ready for this road trip? Destination one is Castelletto, down on the coast. This route has some of the best driving roads in the world. Make the most of them. All right, we're headed to Castelletto. I just want to get it, let you guys hear this awesome car. Sounds amazing. Um, anyways, what I was saying, we're getting back into this Let's Play, and uh, unfortunately, I do have a cold. Uh, as you guys can probably tell, my voice sounds a little uh, scratchy, and that, that's just because I do have like a sinus cold and whatnot. So uh, I do apologize that for that uh, ahead of time, if I ever have to cough or anything like that. So just bear with me. Uh, uh, I've had this cold for a good. I don't know, going on probably two weeks now, which kind of sucks, but, I mean, it is what it is. I got a cold. What, am, what What can you do about it? Look at this thing. It loves to be out in the dirt. It's actually not a bad handling car. I mean, you can tell it's a, it's a boat and it's a little heavy, but, I mean... And that sound, though. She loves it. Let's see if we can get her sideways. Oh, yeah. This could be a future drift build, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, cool. Hit the brakes on me. Why don't, why don't you do that again? Look at this thing. Look, that body roll, though. back into cockpit view just for a little bit here. Oh, she doesn't really like to be held sideways. What was that Pagani Zonda or whatever the hell that is? Getting in front of me and then slamming on the brakes. I don't understand why cars do that in this game. 
Normally you don't pass someone to get in front of them and slam on your brakes, unless you're just an asshole. But I mean, I don't know. Jivatar logics. Oh, okay. You can, or just come up next to me and bump into me. That's cool, too. So we are headed to Castelletto. Oh, gotta get this sign. Yeah, what up? Car's a little smash up, but... The overall, overall look of this car is just fantastic. I mean... That could just be my love of Chevys and Camaro background kicking in. I am kind of partial to Chevy just because that's what I've grown up with. That's what my father has always been into, and now that's what I'm into, and for a good reason, because Chevrolet makes an amazing muscle car, and they make amazing cars in general, so... I mean, I'm not going to go out there and be like, yeah, it's the best manufacturer ever. This one's the American Racers Championship. Some genuine icons on show here. Camaro, Mustang, Javelin, true classics. Okay, mate, choose an event and we'll get this show started. Um, unfortunately, my Elgato had a little issue, I guess, and the uh, whole road trip didn't get recorded. So uh, now we are in this racing event. We're going to choose this cliffside sprint here which is uh, pretty much right behind us. But here it is, this awesome up. Camaro. We're actually going to do these wheel spins real quick just because uh, we actually have them, and we might as well because maybe we can win a couple cool cars or we can win $5,000. All right, let's see what else we will uh, we will get. I think I have a couple of these saved up, so hopefully we'll get something good. We'll get another 11000 Not bad. Anything else? Come on, we want a car. Let's get something good. We'll get another 11k. So we just got some money. That's that's fine with me. We're gonna uh... yards, turn right. look at this car though. Come on, Van. Go, jeez. This thing is so awesome. Big fan of Chevrolet and uh, the Camaro. So I'm, I'm really happy to be driving this right now. You have arrived at your destination. Cliffside Sprint. Let's go. I do apologize for uh, my voice. I am still struggling with a cold. It's been like two weeks now. I, I have like a sinus cold. And um, that's why my throat does sound a little scratchy, and I, I do apologize for that. But I'm trying my best. I wanted to record for you guys because I haven't in like two weeks. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna try to struggle through it. Hopefully, get over this cold as soon as possible, and then uh, we'll just keep going, keep uploading content. But right now, we're gonna race and hopefully win.
try to keep it as keep it as clean as possible. Mine's going through this stuff. She is a little slow, but uh, compared to the the Plymouth Cuda, I believe that did have a significant amount more horsepower. But I got more balls, and I'm not as great, not afraid to bump into people. Because I'm gonna have to if I'm gonna win this race, I think. Just because I do have a, uh, a lack of power compared to a majority of these cars. Unless it's that one, because that's the same car that I have. Oh yeah, getting them on the inside. Whoa, that's a tight corner. Here we go, back to square one. Gonna make up all those, all that ground again. And we're running out of check, we're running out of room because I can see the finish. Passing on the grass. Yeah. Got it through that checkpoint. We almost missed that checkpoint. I didn't even see it, honestly. And I almost drove right around it. That would have been bad. But we made it. It's all good. Gonna get this win real fast and then we'll move on to the next event. Come in sideways. You made that look easy. Got 20 points. Starting the championship off good. Camaro's a little banged up, but nothing, nothing major. Nothing that uh, a real person back in the day would have done to this car. I hope I hit no thanks. I didn't want to race that guy. I think I did, but who knows? Cool, we didn't do it. I kind of want to go find this barn find, but I know it's going to take me forever, so... Where's this one go? We'll do this one just because it sticks around this area, and then after that we'll go find um, that left. barn car. Turn Try to at least. Usually it takes me forever, but... Take this thing off-road because I know it wants to be off-road. Yeah! Get a little air here, maybe? No. You have arrived at your thing was hauling ass. Doesn't have the greatest stopping, though, that's for sure. Thing is definitely a boat. Alright. Round two. Castelletto circuit race event two of four. Oh, I see me. Let's do this. Roasting the tires. No big deal. There's that Cuda just pulling on me. See it to the left. Eh, it's out of screen now, but. See how long we can race in, in this view. Just so you can guys you guys can see the car and enjoy its beauty. It tacks out so high and I love it. It's so awesome. Passing on the grass. Oh, I thought I missed that checkpoint. I would have been so pissed. Lost a little bit of speed there. Tried to get him on the inside, but didn't work out. We'll get him right here. I'm 
Maybe not. Yeah, we gotta run on him. Ooh, rev limiter. Here we go. Lap two, I think. Just trying to stay off the dirt, but that didn't happen. All right, we're gonna go into cockpit view now that we got the lead. Just because I think I put better laps in in this view, honestly. Um, I tend to be able to handle the car a little better in this view just because I can't see the ass end. And this thing does have a big ass. Dad ass, though. And uh, a lot of times when you see the back end like swerving around, it kind of kind of messes with you. I am getting a lot better in that view, though. I, I do have to say that. Uh, I have been practicing in this in that view a lot more and I'm gonna get past right here if I don't shut up and focus bouncing right off the walls that shouldn't have even counted I should have missed that checkpoint but I guess my car hit it so it's all good it was the finish Aw, thanks, man. I know. I, I tried my hardest. By the way, guys, this Camaro is all completely bone stock. Um, pretty much just doing this whole race with it stock, and then afterwards, uh, I'll probably do a drift build out of it. I'm not going to lie. Just because I think this thing would be so sick to be uh, built as a drift car. Definitely going to keep the v big V8 in it, and we'll just lighten it up, lower it, and then... Go from there, I guess. I mean, I'm sure it'll drift really well. It already handles really well as it is, and it's ridiculously heavy. Alright, so this barn find is around here somewhere. Let's go look for this real quick before we uh, venture out. Okay. We'll head over here first, just to check, make sure nothing's uh, over here. I don't think this is it. This isn't your typical barn find building. Usually they look uh, pretty normal. Well, they all look the same, actually. I can't really say they look normal, because it's just stupid. They all, all the barns look the same. They look like the old, beaten down, abandoned barn. By the way, guys, um, if you haven't noticed, I do now have a car club that you guys can join. It is KSTV. Um, that's the, the clan tag I guess um, it is actually called K store customs so feel free to uh, join that if you guys are a fan of the YouTube uh, channel and whatnot a fan of my uh, my videos and everything and uh, if you are then feel free to join the club then that way whenever I'm online you guys can see me we can do some uh, online open lobbies and everything that'll be really cool uh, I'd really like to <clears throat> get into some lobbies with you guys and do that so that being said go join the club all right that's not it we're gonna find it I'm telling you usually it takes forever for me to find these things but I sorta of know what to look I, I like I know what the building looks like it's just hard trying to locate where it is hmm where do we want to go I don't know where to go oh this looks like a uh, good possibility I think this is where we just were though 
I don't know. It's right here. Nice. We found it. Yeah. So this noob, I tell him, dude, it's way too much car for you. But they never listen. Been there. So <laughs> noob. Oh, the Ferrari. Oh, wow. Is that a Ferrari 250 GT? One of the most sought after cars in the world. You heard the story, right? Back in the 70s, this famous Greek singer was playing in Castelletto. After his gig, the car won't start, and he moves on, and then it gets to be too much trouble to fix, and who knows? This could be it. This toy's in bad shape, though. We'll fix it up then, damn it. Hey, I'll bring the truck around and get her back to the garage. It'll be a while, but I'll get her restored to her former glory and give you a shout. Awesome. Just got another barn find, guys. Look how beautiful this car is. You can't say it's not a gorgeous looking car. I love it. It looks so good. Which, uh, I kind of want to take a picture of it before it's trashed, but we'll be all set. Listen to that thing, though. Looks amazing. We'll go do this race up here real fast. Now that we found that barn find. Go flying through this field. Yeah! Dukes of Hazard style, except that was with a Charger and this is a Camaro. She does love to be held though, that is for sure. <clears throat> Voice is struggling, guys. I'm sorry. <coughs> Event three of four. So, if you guys didn't notice, I actually am using a, another mic as well. <coughs> I did get a new mic set up, and I am currently using the Audio Technica AT2035. I'm uh, still working out the kink, so if the audio isn't that great, uh, I, I do apologize. Uh, this is a completely new setup. This is the first day uh, I've actually been using it as well, so still getting used to it, still trying to learn uh, all the new tricks and, and whatnot to it, and that's definitely not how to start off a race. So we'll go back to here. We'll get in, we'll resume from here, get in cockpit view, and then do some work. I know, I'd just much rather race in this view because I, know, I feel like it's the best view to drive in. You can just, I don't know, I can just feel the car better in this view. Personal preference, everyone's different. I'm sure a lot of you guys uh, just would rather drive in third person view all the time, which I don't mind that view at all. It's just, I'd rather drive like this. Look at all these camera, these cars I need to take pictures of. That is a good way to get money in this game, though. It just takes. Uh, it doesn't. It doesn't take long. It just. It kind of ruins flow of the game, especially when you're mid race. Come on, car! You got this. thing definitely likes to go though has a lot of potential trust me I, I can't wait to put some money into this car that is a nice corner right there wow I gotta try to remember that little section for the next drift build the next S-Class drift build, I should say. I don't know if A-Class could do that um, efficiently. Mm. 
went around that corner a little slow, but I think that's kind of what I had to do. Unlike this one, I'm just drifting. You lose so much speed drifting, that's the only problem. I see a checkpoint. Holding it. Third gear tapped. <clears throat> I haven't even really tested this car out completely. I mean, I guess this is a good test for it, but I, I, I kind of want to see what the top speed of is it. Uh, what well, the top speed is um, completely stock before I do anything to it. So I might do that after as well. She's a little banged up again, but nothing major. It's okay, I'll buff out. And we got another wheel spin. What up? Level 58. And I'm not even half late, like halfway through the career mode or whatever. That's all from just drifting online. Top of the pile, another championship win. People are starting to talk about you, you know. This is the sort of form that could take you all the way to the finale. <laughs> 